Michelle Knight. This is the astrological update for Gemini for the week starting the 14th of April. Now this week, Pluto, the Lord of the underworld and transformation is going retrograde. And for you, it's all about primal emotions. Suddenly, you may remember a trauma from the past. You may be thinking about primal emotions that have ruled you in the past. Jealousy, lust, passion, fear, pain, some, something that happened in the past. However, Pluto isn't dragging you back there for any old reason. It's dragging you back there so that you can transform, so that you can heal, so that you can turn the lead of that experience into the gold of your soul. This is a challenging week because there's also a Cardinal Grand Cross. But the good news is for you before that is Mercury and Uranus are conjunct. And for you, unexpectedly, one of your dreams may come true or something that you connect with someone or something happens that makes you feel very happy indeed. The full moon on the 15th is quite intense for you. It brings about joy and happiness and maybe a new understanding of what it is to have fun and be happy. The Cardinal Grand Cross the big lesson for you is security versus making your dreams come true. Trying to keep your feet on the ground when you are manifesting your desires. And also that tricky little Pluto could bring up some emotions that are out of control or primal. And, you know, this is important energy for you because as a Gemini, often you don't like to be plunged into out of control emotions or experiences. But, you know, you've got to work with that energy and see what happens. The Grand Water Trine on the 17th is healing us all and allowing us to kind of move forward and, and shift things. And basically and fundamentally for you, it's helping you realize your value and your worth, particularly when it comes to your career and who you are in the world. Take care and I'll speak to you soon.